If you are a Samsung user and don't want ads to pop while using the mobile then this is the video you need to watch. In this video I'm going to share you step by step process how to set up your Samsung mobile after formatting or right after unboxing that to ads free. So let's start. By the way this is for all Samsung mobiles. First select the language here. After that you will get this. This is the most important thing. People in hurry select agree to all but you don't. Apart from selecting the last option, select the first two. Don't select the sending of diagnostic data. Next, it asks to connect for Wi-Fi. You can skip it if in case you don't want. Now select the date and time. This is not a big thing. The SIM card will take care. Click on next. Here also one more option you need to uncheck. Scroll down to the last. You will get the device maintenance. There you uncheck this send usage and diagnostic data. Now click on next. Here it asks to protect your mobile by adding fingerprint, pin or password. You can skip it and add it later in settings. Click on next. This is another important step. Here it show you to install the recommended apps and you can check or uncheck this. My recommendation is uncheck all these. You don't need anything. In my mobile it is showing only one application. Maybe in your mobile more than one it is showing. Uncheck all the things and you don't need these apps. If in case you want you can download it from Galaxy Store easily. Now click on next. Here it asks you to log in with the Samsung account. You can skip this step and add it in later in the settings. There is no issue with that. Click on skip. Here it shows the Samsung services. You can uncheck all these then click on next. Now it asks you which display you prefer light or dark. Select it and click on next then finish. That's all. Now you successfully done the setup process of your Samsung mobile ads free. Also one more thing whenever you open any Samsung app like Galaxy Store or Samsung related app right after opening it it asks you like promotional content by default it's checked just untick that and enter into the app because Samsung want advertisements in their mobiles so be careful with that. That's the video. If you think this is helpful for you, don't forget to like this and also subscribe to this channel for more technology and mobile related videos. Thank you so much in advance and I'll see you again in the next video.